Servus. My name is Alexander Strauss. Uh, I'm from Norway, Bergen, uh, 46 years old, uh, married, two children, and just arrived in München. The first weeks was very, very busy. I spent most of my time here at the campus, but now in the last couple of weeks I have uh, managed to explore the city a little bit more. And it's a beautiful city with a lot of different things to, to see. And also the Bavarian culture reminds me a lot of uh, the culture from my area where I come from in Norway. Yes. It's fantastic. when it was clear that I was going to come here and uh, about all these things that you have heard about the club. So I started to do some research on the club. Of course, the club has probably done some research on me before they, they, they reached out to me. So when they did, I did some research also on the club and I found a lot of things with the club that I didn't do before because I knew a lot about Bayern München. Of course, it's a big club. But when you start going into the depth of the club, and we start looking at the philosophy of Mia San Mia, all these things are really connected to those things. It made me feel like this could be a good home for me. And that's why I wanted to come. And that's why I'm here today. Now I've been doing professional coaching for the last 12 years. So I think I'm uh, getting more and more experienced and uh, I think I'm quite calm during the games. I like the, I like the players to put a lot of trust in the players and the staff's ability to do their, their job. But I'm also very enthusiastic, so there is like a paradox there. I really like, I have a really strong winning mentality. I want to win, but I also want to win in the right way. That's the thing. Sometimes difficult because to do things in a beautiful way, uh, the aesthetic way of playing football that that some of us like, it's, um, it's, uh, it doesn't mean anything if you don't win. So I try to, to fulfill both those, uh, those spots. But the team, I think we want to attack a lot. We want to have a lot of uh, possession on the ball. We want to control the games, which I believe a team of, uh, of uh, our club uh, should do. That's one of the, the heritage of, of being by München. It's, it's a huge club and we need to conduct ourselves on the pitch in that way of what we represent. And, and uh, so we need to control, we need to dominate the games and we need to win a lot of games, of course. Really important for me to, to say is that it's not that you come into this club uh, to try to change, put everything, change everything. A lot of things has been good. Of course, there will be some differences because I have maybe a different philosophy and I'm in some parts of the game and uh, that's what I try to bring. But it's, for me, it's not about changing because the team has been doing really, really well. We win a lot of games. I think we were second last year and we have gone far in Champions League the last two years. So the team has been doing really, really well. So, so we don't want to change everything. But we want to change something to see if we can develop a little bit more, uh, especially in our attacking game. Yeah, I think we need to have the mentality to, to every time we put on a shirt with the, with the Bayern logo uh, on the chest. It doesn't matter if it's point or if it's trophies. It's just a matter of, of pride and to win matches for this this club, and that is uh, the main thing. And I, I probably think that this is already here. The game is faster and faster. So we need players who can comprehend that type of, 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 of play. I think it will be a lot of more questions asked to the physical part, but also the tactical parts, because the game is getting more and more tactical also in the women's side. So you cannot uh, win games just by individual quality. You also need to have uh, the strength. You need players to understand, to make decisions on the pitch. So if you go back 10 years or, or five years, or even four years back in time, 
I think it's it's already evolved a lot. So I think it, it, that will be the main things in, into the future as well. And I think you see it also more and more the last years that it's more and more the big, big uh, clubs that are dominating also in the women's side, in the Champions League and also in the in the domestic leagues around uh, Europe. So I think that's an important step also because you have the infrastructure in the big clubs. All these things demand more from, from the clubs and from the players and from the staff and everybody to keep up with the front runners of the of the clubs and of course we hope that we will be one of the front front runners in that in that race so the rest needs to keep up i think dominating uh, exciting and uh, the last one is uh, controlling I would say the enthusiastic, loyal, uh, and impatient. <laughs> so that's a difficult uh, question. I'm more into principles than, than uh, systems. I adapt the systems to the players that we have. But the last years I played three or four three. And uh, I think that's very dynamic for the team I've coached. So. I like American football as well, to be honest. That's uh, one of my my uh, my uh, other sports. Depends. <laughs> it depends on which day and which time in the in the week. Uh, no, I will say easy. I will uh, go for a beer. Good German beer. I'm really into Mexican food, to be honest. I really like spicy food. So Mexican food, I really like. Yes, uh, I do. Of course, servos uh, is an important one to learn early. Uh, I also learned a little bit more like greeting sentences here, like habe die Ehre. I know it's a big, big, big uh, important thing. Probably the start will be a little bit difficult, maybe. Thank you. Servus.